happen for us is that we were the inexperienced team. Uh, our nerves were going to be rattled a little bit, and it was really evident in the first four minutes of the game, four or five minutes. My goal is that we really wanted to score early to take some of the edge off, and it took us a little bit to get going. We got four great looks at the rim that uh, went in and out, and if only one of those would have fallen, we probably would have gotten going a little bit quicker. Um, our number one goal this year for a program that has just new into the Division II was to get to the playoffs, and some people told me that that was too lofty of a goal, and that was what it was, and that's what I sold with my freshmen, that that's what we wanted to have happen. We wanted to get to the playoffs, but we just didn't want to be here. We wanted to compete. And I don't think we played particularly well the last two times we played Monterey Bay. I think that they kind of had their way with us. And our number one focus tonight was playing defense. And clearly when you hold a team to 20 points below their average, you're playing some defense. And so um, I think I'm most proud of that. Talk a little bit more about the importance of you have no seniors on the team, a lot of freshmen, and about the importance of getting there and getting those experiences as you go forward now building the program. Well, actually, we do have one senior, uh, Frida. And so she's been with the program for four years. So she's the only one left over from going from the NAIA stage into uh, Division II. So from going forward here, the message that I said to the young kids in the locker room was that this is a feeling that you want to have. You want to be playing this. You want this experience every single time. And that your focus needs to be not about the loss. Your focus needs to be about the next time you want the game to be on your home floor. And so we want to be in the playoffs every year. We want this environment. We want these kinds of challenges. So our goal next year, would, instead of being on the road, was to be top four and be hosting a game. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, I think it's coaching. Um, you know, that's a joke. Uh, we just really tried changing things up a little bit defensively what we were doing. We did not have the same plan that we played against them the last two times. And we've, I've watched a lot of film. There's only so much you can cram into a student athlete's brain. And so the l sometimes less is more. And we just did a couple of little different tweaks. And our number one focus was to stop ball and stop the three. And the last, one last question. Sure. You had the two injuries. That, oh, uh, and, and how much of a difference does, does that make in your season? And how did you get? You had the big win at the end of the season, even without the injured player. So talk yeah, about I mean. We lost Haga, I don't even know when we lost her, four weeks ago. We lost Haga before we even went on the foreign game win streak. We lost Cassie at, uh, at Chico. Uh, we've played a game at Sonoma with seven players. Um, it's, it's really all about the uh, passion and the heart of these kids and them not wanting to let each other down. And so that was what it was for us. Good? All right, awesome. Thank you.